one thing about our culture and our core values is owning the problem, owning the solution. We are loyal to our team members. So we don't hide or cover up mistakes or throw people under the bus, which yeah. all those individually we could talk about for 10 minutes, right? <laughs> you don't, you don't hide cover up your mistakes or throw your someone on your team under the bus yeah as a matter of fact if you want to get fired yeah from our team the quickest way to do that is to try to cover up a mistake mm -hmm. throw someone else under the bus or know that there's a problem that's costing us money and not say anything about it yep right 100 percent. that's the easiest and quickest way to get let out <laughs> <laughs> uh, that there is if you bring a problem we will probably reward you mm -hmm. uh, and i this is another thing that i just truly do not get about um, corporate structure and business owners when someone brings up a challenge and in just a second i'll tell you as a as a team member how to bring up a challenge right because there are there are ways to do it and ways to not do it good point but, but when someone brings a challenge to you and you are negative in any way about that, why would someone want to bring up another challenge? I mean, you're, you're basically telling them by your actions that you don't want to hear problems. And as a business owner, you have to hear the problem. You're literally in business. The reason that you have a business is because you solve problems. Business owners solve problems. That, otherwise, you wouldn't have a business. Yeah. You taught me that really well in our last quarterly interviews. We didn't even really talk about it much, but um, someone brought up feedback and I was a little defensive and you kind of took the reins and said, that is a great idea. We're going to talk about it. And you, and it was a good idea, but I, my initial reaction was to get defensive and to it say, was, well, but, but, but <laughs> I mean, I, I can see as a, as a, as a leader, business owner, it was something that you're like, but, but. I, I could have butted that thing all day long. I could have just said, yeah, but what about this over here? And what about this over here? Mm -hmm. And it took me a little while in business to understand that you, that maybe, maybe there's some truth. There's always this like kernel of truth. So why don't we look for the kernel of truth in what was just said? So yeah. the, the, yeah, buts probably have some truth to them too. But if there's a kernel of truth in here, why don't we find it and fix it? Because obviously it got brought up for a reason. There's obviously yeah, yeah. something wrong, right? Yeah. So let's try to fix that. Because if I can fix it and that makes everybody happier, well then again, we're just gonna get better output. We're gonna do more business. Everybody's gonna be happy. And then I'm not gonna lose somebody in addition, right? Where yeah. I could have if they just don't say anything and they're and they're upset about something. It's um, true. So it's really, really important, really important. When people love what they do and they love their job, I mean, when I have free time, sometimes I'm, you know, if my, if my husband's out with the kids and I've gotten my stuff done on a Saturday, it is not uncommon for me to pull up my work email and get some stuff done. Cause I love it. I love my clients. I love what I do. And so that's in large part because of this, you know, the things we've talked about today.